Kwa mara ya kwanza kinara Raila Odinga alijitokeza kwa umma baada ya kukosa kuonekana zaidi ya wiki moja. Kinara huyo na viongozi wa azimio walikosa kuhudhuria maandamano walioitisha wiki jana na leo Odinga alijieleza. Down with the flu. Katika kikao na wanahabari wa vyombo vya kimataifa Odinga alieleza sababu za kufutilia mbali maandamano ya kesho. The reason why we called off uh, tomorrow's uh, maandamano so that people can keep vigil. Kupitia taarifa kwa vyombo vya habari muungano utaandaa mkesha badala ya maandamano kwa ajili ya waliouawa na polisi pamoja na kufariji familia. Raila leo amedokeza mipango ya kusaidia familia za walioathirika. We also going to launch uh, a fund to help those families who have lost their, 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 their relatives and those who are still in hospital. Odinga hata hivyo ameshikilia kuwa maandamano bado yataendelea kuwa ni Kenya kwanza imekuwa hisiki vilio vya wakenya na wameendelea kukijali katiba. As the process is going on in court they are busy implementing and defying the court orders. And that's the reason why it cannot be just one process. It has to be both. Okiem Tata and his team will fight in court. Our people will fight on the street. Kuhusu maandamano kuharibu uchumi wa taifa. Lakini serikali inasemaje kufuatia azimio kusema kesho hakuna maandamano? Walikaa wakatangaza wengine wakasema sijui ni kesho. Tukawaambia kujeni. Sasa wameingia kwa nyasi amesema sijui nini 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 namna hii hata hivyo Odinga anashikilia kuwa serikali ya Kenya kwanza haina lolote kwa Kenya kwani hata ufisadi umeongezeka tangu ichukue usukani corruption has gone up more than double since Uhuru left the, the government so there are many issues why this government is not coming up and i just want to assure you even if they give another five years they will not come up Martin Opio Runinga ya K24 Nairobi